following footage contains a lot of dialogue and cutscenes. If you do not like those, then have a good day. Let's see. What's up with the egg? Okay, they've put the the blankets themselves themselves. Attack! We're under attack! Come on, I run! Take cover! What? From them? Just Help! Kill them in one hit. Are you kidding me? Just one bird? Eat this. It's gonna crash on the egg. No! Oh, yacht. I'm ready to revert, but save my baby. <laughs> Watch out! No! Look, it's hatching. Come on, baby. You can do it. Come on. No. Hang on. Just one last push. Please. Yes! Oh my god, yes! That's my baby! You can do this! Where are you going? Stay here! Come to Mama! Bye-bye. Spread your wings, baby Galanta. This Wait is a minute. disgusting Blood inside. Wings. Just disgusting. I have 300, thank you very much, finally. Now we can do the Glide Energy Saver. Next time we're gonna do this. My weapon. I need more grand stuff. Probably incubated, waiting for oh this one. But the drones, what drones? Where are you? Oh, it just stayed there. You did it, Doc. How does it feel? It's the most important day of my life, Ulukai. I'm so excited to finally meet her. Yeah. I remember that feeling. I have a daughter too, you know. The invaders' drones are buzzing around your girl like angry bees. I feared this would happen. Each sting she endures will be a blow to her growth. Can you destroy those drone patrols and keep my daughter safe? I have kept that a many. question. Do you have any clue how to raise a baby Galenta? He doesn't. I don't need any. I feel it in my essence. A mother always knows what to do with her progeny. Why he calls himself a oh mother boy. and not a father? My baby needs time with her mother. She needs to eat and grow. How about you go hush-hush on the whole mother-baby thing? I mean, is that even legal around here? It's the will of the gods, Ulukai. Do you want to be the father? <laughs> no. Oh, I, I already got a kid. And they sometimes say two is one too many, and I have all that fighting to do. Wouldn't be home much to provide and all. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, my friend. You did enough, and the Yards are grateful. It only takes one parent to make things right. Uh, I will be a good mother. Go be a good father to your own child, my friend. Don't Get really there. agree. Hopefully. You need two parents. Come see. To make a kid like destroy. Yeah. Can I choose or are you choosing for me? Yeah, I'm, I wanna do this, but... That's it? No way that's it. 
Oh, we have another one, okay. don't have any more I just saw that I don't have any more ammo oh this is bad just can you stop thank you I'm gonna change it back because it my ammo is running way too fast and I'm already one-shotting I maybe use it when I'm in the boss room but not now okay let's get this one I see more. Doc, hey. here you are, partner. Uh, nothing. Come see me. Maybe I should talk about the happiness, hey, and it's gonna here open you... the last thing. Your Galanta looks like she's getting bigger by the minute. Not big enough. All this stress has made her sad. I can see it in her eyes. Lucky her. Sadness makes me gain weight. But I can blame it all on a tub of ice cream. This is Adolfa Ulukai. Here, growth is quickened by happiness. It's important we keep my daughter happy. We? What do you want me to do? Rub her belly? Take her for a walk? A walk? Yes, exactly! Can you walk her? Doc, I was joking. No, you are a genius! Taking her for a peaceful, relaxing stroll is just what she needs. Doc, nothing's peaceful and relaxing outside of Amiya. She won't be safe. Please, walk her. Bring her happiness. Help her grow. Let's keep it moving. I'm just... I just have to be around this thing. Can I be on top? <laughs> That's amazing. Now it's just a turret mission. Just have to shoot whatever comes close. stuff we're gonna get closer yep here we go guys you guys dead right <laughs> do you enjoy the not the totally not peaceful stroll we having Like a, uh, how, do you, how do you call it? The 
things that in the rivers. A water cow? A river? Something? Oh, I can hear the mosquito in my ear, it's annoying. Did you, did you enjoy the trip? Teabagging you? More can I just stay here? Longer. That's another one for my resume. Or she's gonna keep... Nope, she just disappeared. Hey, Doc. Now you're happy. Here you are, partner. And nothing Come more. Come see me. I am gonna try and. Yep, I can. This is nice. She's just slowly, slowly moving. Protect from danger. I mean, I don't have anything more to do. I'm just waiting. Oh, Thanks for your help, Kurek. I did it! I made a major discovery! You're talking about the egg? I don't want to keep you. Guess I'm going here now. Now we're gonna meet Lihaz, Lihaz, whatever her name is. What? Just down here? Boop, on your head. Emerheed. Hey, Emerheed. How are you? Not too bad, Ulukai. Always busy researching ancient mysteries. Well, I finished all the essence shrines. Have you heard about any new essence shrines? Not on this side of Adelpha. It seems you've unlocked them all. Yep. That's it. All right, see it. Nothing more to say. After you. I literally have nothing to do here. This is kind of sad. Hi there. Got some. Yes. Do you know anything of? The Sun is a village in the far northeast, in the hostile region of Sar. It's built on the top of stone pillars that are rich in helidium. Yeah, been there. From what I hear, there's a massive invader presence there. Not anymore. Do you know anything about Procriana? Procriana was the capital of Adelpha and its most important center of knowledge. Famous for its scholars, recreators, and researchers. But that's in the past. It was attacked by the invaders many moons ago. And most citizens ran away, fearing further reprisals. It's located in the northwest of Ganzar. Okay. Do you know anything about Amia? Amia is a forest. Okay, of... this one I don't want to know because I'm just. See you around. Come back. I need to finish their quest. I know what Amia is. So I'm guessing they don't have anything more to offer. Nice. Let's. Hi there. Yes. Yeah. See. Come back. It's the same. Sadly. Hmm. Is this finished, by the way? Nope. Still halfway there. We're halfway there. This space is force field is still active, I know. Mm. Guess let's go to Vida and do their quests.
Let's go talk to the chief. Hopefully he is more nice. Nicer. Who calls the shots around here? I am Hiram, chief of Bida. But you got the wrong information, stranger. We don't drink Lampe in shots. Lampe is best served in a pint cold as the Palana snow. Who are you? I'm Cutter Slade. What did they say about Lampe? To help. How are you guys holding up? A cold drink of Lampe smooths away the rough edges. Things could be worse, things could be better. Spoken like a true politician. What's the village of Bida famous for? What planet did you fall from? Lampe, of course. We have pretty decent Tuan Ha's, too, but they don't drive Bida's economy. How come the other villages don't produce Lampe? Our water is exceptional. You can't make Lampe without exceptional water. Are you guys also selling water? Selling water? You mean in, in a mool? Who would be stupid enough to buy bottled water? You got a point there. <laughs> But don't discard the idea just yet. It's a potential gold mine. Mm-hmm. Where are the invaders? Outside town. Drilling stations. So the village is safe? Hardly. All the drilling brings the Garondars to the surface towards Garondars? us. Yacht damn hmm. creatures never used to roam these lands. Good thing that the village is preserved for some reason. You know why? I'm the mouth that sells, not the brain that overthinks what it cannot influence. Mirko tried to explain it to me over a pint of lampe last night. But hey, I don't think at night. I party. He parties. What's a Garandar? A devouring beast living below us. I figured that much. Any other details you want to share, Chief? Watch your step. When a Garandar surfaces, Bonbars are eaten and Talons revert. Hmm. So, seriously, what is Lampe? Lampe is the finest drink in Adelphi. It's the reason I wake up every afternoon. So that makes you an Sounds afternoon like a commercial. only chief. Part-time job? Are you a little wasted right now? No, I am the chief after all. But tonight I will drink and sing. Lampe makes you sing better than the Al Mayel and sleep sounder than a reverted Talan. You want some? We no, have thank discounts you. for I'm new on customers. The job. Are you a chief or a salesman? My role is to sell more Lampe than I consume. Bida's economy depends on it. Don't want to buy it. About bond bars. Look, I am in the process of rejuvenating my essence, and words use energy. Talk to Ozak about bond bars. He's not called a bond bar boy because of his Tuan Ha. I'm looking to acquire a shipment of Lampe. Why? Lampe. Can you help me? I don't deal with the Zorkins. I'm the marketing guy. Talk to Marzo if you want to make a... Okay, I guess. Later, Chief. Farewell. I talked to the chief, now what? I found him and I talked to him. I don't really want to buy, yes? I guess I'll just talk to everybody. Flash, I'm not a kid. I'm all grown up. But if you see me as a kid, you probably have a problem <laughs> with your eyes. Let's test your ears now. The name's Mirko. So, what's my name? Um, Mirko? Bingo! It's just the eyes then. Now, on with the mandatory speech. Welcome to the brewery. What brings you to Bida? Ooh. Drilling stations. What are the invaders drilling for? Well, I have a theory, but it's too dangerous for me to even go near the drilling stations to confirm it, so 
you know, maybe we'll just never know because this village isn't interested in knowledge, it's interested in Lampe. Do you know what Lampe does to your brain? It's like I'm helping my dad brew an anti-knowledge potion. Say I would be interested in verifying your theory. Should I put my ass on a line and go out there? Your ass? <laughs> Why? No! I don't want you to put your ass anywhere. But if you're half as curious as I am, you could look inside one of their drill pits and maybe bring me whatever you find. Or they destroyed why one. Why would I do that? My theory, dude. I'm smart. I want to do something with my life, but I can't do much with this broom in my hand. If you help me prove it, I promise you'll have something to use against the invaders. You're a fighter. I can tell. So, what's your theory? I don't want to blow your mind quite yet. So, what if you find anything interesting in the drill pits? I would be thrilled to examine it. It's up to you. What do you know about Garandars? Well, there's the obvious huge worms, extremely dangerous, too. But, and the less obvious part, please. They're like me, they're misunderstood. They're not coming to the surface to eat us. They're just trying to get away from the underground drilling. It's hurting their little <laughs> worm ears. Well, I doubt. Huge worm ears. Actually, I'm not sure how big their ears are. They haven't attacked the village? No, and I found out why. There's a very small life form in our water supply that's toxic to Garon bars, but harmless to you or me. Well, I don't know about you. We should test that later. How did you find that out? Dude, I told you. I'm the only Talan in Bida besides Dorga who went to Procreana University. I've got a brain. Stick Bro around, science. You might learn a thing or two. <laughs> I only like cocky when I'm the smartest guy in the room. Not liking it now. I found this white stone in the drill pits. It's light as a feather and it emits a familiar glow. What do you think? Oh, wow, yes, yes, this must be it. Oh, I keep telling people there's white helidium on this continent, but no one believes me. But this is proof. My anti-gravity theory is accurate. You're Andy what now? Gravity is an advanced concept. I could try to teach you, but you wouldn't understand. I know what gravity is. Don't ask me for the formula, though. Forgot everything they taught me in high school. And high school, actually. All right, all right. So stay with me. I'm gonna use big words. Garondars live so deep underground that the pressure of the earth would crush them flat. But they don't get crushed. Why? Because they emit an anti-gravity field. I'm not sure how they generate it, but it has to do with eating these rocks, white helidium. That's what the invaders are drilling for. They want to harness its power. Sounds. How do you know all that? Legit. I read a ton of scrolls. Yeah. Again, bro you, science. You said if I helped prove your theory, we'd have the power to fight the invaders. I hope you don't want me to eat this rock. No, although that would be pretty hilarious. This leads me to my other theory, which is you can train a Garondar to attack invaders instead of Bonbars. Okay. Training Garandars. I'm listening. I've conducted experiments with Tvonhas. You know, the one where you hold a haughty in front of them and they start salivating? Pavlov would be proud. Go on. Garandars are no different. If you manage to trigger a reflex, they won't salivate, but they should show up at the precise location of the stimuli. Hold on. Why would I summon a Garandar that wants to eat me? Once trained, you won't have to fight it. I will calibrate the beacon so the Garondar doesn't surface, but comes close enough so that you can benefit from its anti-gravity field in combat. If you train more than one Garondar the same way, it will only make the effect stronger. This might actually work. What do you need to make this happen? I already mapped out everything in a scroll. See? Okay. We could use fey fruits to create a vibration, okay? I have and a few. that vibration will attract the Garondar. The scent of meat, say, Gamor meat, will make its surface. 
If we shoot white halidium directly into the Garondar's mouth when it surfaces, it's like a reward. <laughs> whoa, whoa, slow down. I'm no pitcher. There's no way I could throw a rock into the mouth of a moving Garondar. But you know how to shoot a gun, right? We just need to manufacture a training beacon that contains the necessary ingredients. Looks like you have everything figured out. I'm in. Uh, let's Where can I find fey fruits? They grow on the fey tree southeast of Beta, but I, really I can handle that. Just focus on the two other components. It'll be faster if we split the work like we're on a team. Cool, right? Yeah. What can you tell me about the invaders? Well, they don't mess with our village, which is a plus. I like being alive and all. But they want something underneath us, in the ground. And their drillings messing up the Garandar's orientation. Garandars around Beta are the opposite of a plus. You're gonna use the Daoka, now that it's back on? The university is closed. Half of the Dano library is burnt to cinders. Where am I gonna go? Besides, my father wants me to waste my life away in this boring brewery. What are you up to? Well, you see, I should be at Procriana University right now, studying the scrolls, living that canoon life. You know how it goes. But the invaders dropped bombs on my campus, so I'm here, sweeping floors for my dad. That's what you call a major bummer. This is what you call See, it. Ha, 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 ha. You know where to find me. I do. Ah, uh, nice place. You don't look like you're from around here, so I guess my next word should be welcome to Vida. Name's Marzel. You here to drink our planet renowned lampe? <sighs> Shouldn't drink when I'm on the job. Kicking invader ass takes a bit of focus. Mm -hmm. Whoa, invader ass, okay. Why'd you come here to kick that? Maybe you want to build your strength first. Heard some bomb bars or whatever. Save us from extinction. That's what your yods told me to do. So, I'm guessing that means getting rid of the invaders. One bullet at a time. And that's what I got. Bullets and time. If you're here to start a crusade, friend, I won't stop I finished you. finished it. Just keep my boy Mirko out of it. He'd be the first one to sign up. But, uh, I need him here. You don't have much love for the Garandars, huh? You didn't run into any of those goddamn worms on your way here? Damn. Maybe they don't like you. I should hire you to escort my next shipment. Just how dangerous are they? Compared to what? The Nekar plague? Playing with Bugat to run your crotch? They're as dangerous as danger can be, fool. Garon does are the type of beast you want to keep underground. But those drilling stations make them dizzy, and now they're coming up to the surface eating bond bars, talons, and whatever else they can stuff down their gullets. What's a bond bar? How would they know this? Main... What it is? How are you dealing with the invaders? Their damn drilling stations are agitating the Garon bars. That's a big problem. Hard to get my shipments when the delivery people keep getting eaten or smashed up. I have to keep up with my delivery schedule, but it's getting harder and harder. Makes sense. Tell me about Mirko. My son. Super smart. But he has to work a little bit more on his enthusiasm for the family business. I need that boy here. He wants to study, but there's no school in Peter. You're tough. I like that. I got one batch ready now. Can you help escort it to Sapa? Sure. A fella named Zala boarded these barrels of Lampe hundreds of cycles ago, but I can't find anyone brave enough to make the delivery. You got me at brave. I'm your man. Okay, perfect then. Are you ready to go? Sure, let's go. But are you gonna give me actual danger or? in the way come on now move away scoot i said hey there you talking to my twan huh no look no i look ozak i have an urgent delivery to make 
Can you clear the way? I'm trying. But something's getting these bombards real agitated. I can't help you there. It's your job, not mine. Go on. You heard the Talan. Let's move this way. Let the Lampe pass. Come on. Not that way. This way. Don't turn around now. Listen to me. Oh, I don't have all moon. Move out of the way. Scoop. <laughs> Can you at least do something to help me here? Well, they, ah. they moved. Bozak, the stomping! Make it stop now! I, I can't! That's what bombards do! How would you ask a... Oh, oh no! Garendar! Where is it? Is... is it gone? Hopefully it's a, it's a boss battle. And where am I? Am I just standing there? We had to wait until all the ships died and then we actually did something. Because if they don't die, it's not funny. 